So let us lovingly welcome Kadambakananda Maharaj by loudly chanting Gaura Premanandi. We cannot advance in the spiritual life on our own. We need the mercy of the pure devotee of the Lord. And this is the spiritual master. You know, he, it's not because, you know, this one is doing more service or this one is more important for him. He's like equally disposed to all his disciples. So it's just nice to see him always um, inspiring everybody in whatever way he does, you know, with his kirtan, his classes, or just being human. Hare Krishna, good morning. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Krishna is saying in Srimad Bhagavatam, Acharya Mam Vijani Yam. Only through Acharya one can understand Krishna. And Acharya or the spiritual master, he is not different from the Supreme Lord, Sakshadari. Krishna is not giving his mercy directly in this world, generally, in most of the cases. He is giving his mercy through the preachers, through those devotees who are ready to sacrifice everything, their personal comfort, their personal likings and dislikings for the pleasure of Krishna to spread his glory all over the world. Yeah, the spiritual master. I first remember when I met uh, Guru Maharaj, I was immediately captivated by his... Uh, some, something was there, you know, some Hare Krishna. charisma. He's a very charismatic person. And uh, after that I, I heard his kirtan, I, I was mesmerized. Then I heard the lectures and I was really inspired right, by, by the way he's explaining his eloquence, his simplicity, his humility and so on, so many godly qualities. This is the, the person which has the most talents which I ever met in my life. <laughs>
Jai Radhe. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Jai Radhe. Hat er unglaublich viel Energie. Dann fragt man sich, wieso er und warum nicht wir. Wir laufen hier jetzt sechs Kilometer, wir sind alle fertig. Und Maharaj singt die ganze Zeit. Und am Abend das nächste Programm und morgen das nächste Programm und nächste Woche. So geht es immer weiter. Also man sieht wirklich, dass das spirituelle Meister einfach connected ist mit, mit Krishna. Und dass er die Energie von einer ganz anderen Ebene bekommt. Nicht wie wir, wir gehen schlafen, wir müssen essen und ein bisschen Sport. Aber ja, Kanamakamaraj ist wirklich auf einer transzendalen Ebene, ist da ein spirituellen Trip. Und ja, es ist ekstatisch zu sehen, ist sehr inspirierend für uns, was wir auch mal erreichen können eigentlich, wenn wir seinen Fußspuren folgen. Und Harry Bohn, Lodzern. Seine Kraftquelle ist, dass er einfach einen starken Wunsch hat, anderen Gutes zu tun, anderen krishna Bustern weiterzugeben. Und er gibt es sich selbst, er gibt wie eine Mutter eigentlich sich den Kindern gibt, so gibt er sich seinen Schülern und auch anderen. Er gibt er alle seine Energie, seine ganze Kraft dafür. Und da kriegt er auch seine Kraft wieder her. Also er, ist, er wirkt nie müde. Er ist schon 76 Jahre alt und kann, macht viel mehr als ich, der 22 ist. 67. 67. <lacht> Excuse me. Das ist das Erstaunliche. Ne? Ein spiritueller Meister lehrt durch sein Beispiel. Und ähm, Kadamakanana Swami ist, also sein Körper ist jetzt 66 Jahre alt, wird bald 67 Jahre. Und ähm, er ist, ähm, hat eine Stunde auf dem Boot gesungen, nonstop, full power, auf dem Boot gesungen. Dann war hierher ein Weg von ungefähr anderthalb Stunden laufen und er hat diese anderthalb Stunden nahezu mit einer kurzen Unterbrechung auch voll ähm, gesungen und dabei gelaufen. Und getanzt. Und getanzt. Und es ist just, er gibt und gibt und gibt und gibt und gibt und ähm, es ist ähm, unglaublich, das zu sehen, unglaublich diese... Also, ich weiß nicht, wie ein Körper sowas machen kann. Hare 
when you go on a parikrama with Maharaj and hour after hour after an hour the kirtan goes on and you become really joyful and inspired that's definitely there und wie findest du Kandamakanda Swami? Kannst du was über ihn sagen? Was, was, was gefällt dir am besten bei ihm? Weiß ich nicht. Wenn du was Schönes über Kandamakanda Swami muss sagen? Sein Kirtan. Kirtan gefällt dir? Ja? Mhm. Sehr enthusiastisch, ja? Ja. Another thing though that I like very much about Maharaj is here. Uh, his insights, very deep insights about significance of uh, different spiritual places. Maharaj, he really likes to think deeply and to uh, give us the essence, the most important from a certain spiritual place. Like these places, Mamgachi, Vrindavan Das Thakur's birthplace. We were coming with Maharaj many times. And every time he shares newer and newer realizations and it becomes deeper and deeper and deeper. Like this time Maharaj was speaking about compassion. And compassion is very important quality for all the devotees. We should have compassion to all living entities. Jiva Doya, this is one of the most essential points from the philosophy of, uh, of the movement of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. But also compassion to ourselves, because sometimes we, as Maharaj likes to, sh to say very often in his lectures, we fall short on our spiritual path. We see we are not up to the standard. We are falling again and again and again. We should have compassion to us that no matter how many times I fail in my spiritual life, let me just go on. Because my Guru wants this from me, so let me just go on. Powerful associates of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu who was on the topmost level of pure devotional service. In the Chaitanya Sikshamrita, um, Srila Bhaktivinoda Thakur says that one, uh, that a Vaishnava who has ruchi, taste, he can give Shraddha to someone. And uh, yeah, he's, since, since there he's been a constant source of inspiration for me. He's been uh, very kind in engaging me in different types of devotional service and also in keeping me humble by telling me the truth in, uh, in a straightforward way. You know, Maharaj is very straight, straightforward, very uh, jokingly also, he, he tells you the truth. And uh, yeah, I've had many, many beautiful experiences in this relationship of service and uh, instructions uh, which gives you so much uh, clarity, so much understanding, deeper understanding about spiritual life and about yourself as a, as a spirit soul because this is the main principle in spiritual life to understand that we are spirit souls and what is our duty. So definitely Kadama Karma Shantiu now has been perfectly guiding me in this uh, sacred transcendental path. Hare Krishna. Yes, goodbye, goodbye. Yes. Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Hare What's important about a spiritual master? Yeah. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> you have to prepare me for things like this. I just got in front of me. You asked me how to make a samosa, I'll tell you. <laughs> 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 okay then, how do we serve the spiritual master? <laughs> As a, <laughs> My a samosa. samosa. <laughs> make very nice samosas for him. Make kitchri. When he says to make kitchri, you make kitchri. You don't want to make biryani. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Sachidevi, I, I, I just tell you a simple question. What is for you the most 
important aspect of your relationship with the spirit master? Hare 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 Hare